Hello everyone and welcome to the sixth day of the Madras meeting 2022-23. We have a card of eight races. First race is at 1.30 p.m. We are looking at the first race, the Sergeant at Arms Handicap. Handicap for horses rated 0 to 25 in class 5, 4 years old and over, distance 1600 meters. Number one is Wise Dawn. Wise Dawn had four runs in the last OT racing season. We are looking at race number 150, where Wise Dawn finished eighth, which was a six for long race. The winner of this race was Current View. We are looking at three horses in this frame. Number two is Catalyst. Number four, Welcome Chakram. And number five, Swiss Agata. All ran in race number 11 of the current Padras racing season. Catalyst in race number 11 finished seventh, while number four, Welcome Chakram, finished second and number five swiss agata finished sixth the winner of this race was marshall number three is lady blazer lady blazer has benefit of two runs during the current madras racing season race number 11 was the initial outing finished eighth to marshall and uh, what we are looking at is race number 17 also finished eighth to majestic chama we are looking at two horses here number six Bhairava's Queen and number 8, 3 of a kind, both in the same race, race number 132. Bhairava's Queen finished 12th, while number 8, 3 of a kind, who's got benefit of two runs in the last OT season, finished 10th. The winner of this race was Autumn Shah. Number 7 is Roger O'Moore. Roger O'Moore has benefit of one run during the current Madras racing season and what we are looking at is the opening race of this season where Roger O'Moore finished 7th. The winner of this race was Dancing Queen. Race number 2, the Antonio's Handicap. This is for horses rated 20 to 45 in class 4, distance 1800 meters. Number 1 is Dominant. Dominant has benefit of one run during the current Madras racing season, which was race number 12 run over eight furlongs, where Dominant finished second. The winner of this race was Forever, and Dominant has been dropped by three points after this run. Number two, Royal Pearl. This filly has benefit of one run on the opening of the Madras racing season, Race number four, where she ran third in a seven furlong race. The winner of this race was Supreme Runner. Royal Pearl now runs in nine furlongs. We're looking at number three. Number three is Queen of Fame. Queen of Fame has benefit of four runs during the last OT racing season. And what we're looking at is race number 137, where Queen of Fame ran seventh in a mile race. The winner of this race was Albinus. Number four is Cheval Blanc. Cheval Blanc has benefit of one run during the last OT racing season. This is race number 80, which was run at the OT race course, where Cheval Blanc finished eighth in a mile race. The winner of this race was Ibrahimovic. Number five is Masterpiece. Masterpiece has benefit of one run during the current Madras racing season, which was race number five that we are looking at, where Masterpiece finished sixth. The winner of this race was Royal Treasure. Number six here is Showmanship. Showmanship has benefit of one run during the last OT racing season, where Showmanship Finished third, what we're looking at is race number 143, which was run over seven furlongs, where showmanship finished third. The winner of this race was Windermere. Two and a half lengths separated the winner from the third. The showmanship came with a flourish in the last 100 meters and finished a close third. Number seven is Vulcanic. Vulcanic ran once during the last OT racing season, which was race number 135, run over a mile. Vulcanic in this race finished second. The winner of this race was Lakshan. I mean, look at Volcanic. Came charging down with the winner, winning post. Came too soon for Lakshan. I mean, Volcanic finished second. Number eight is Martingale. Martingale has benefit of three runs during the last OT racing season. 
Just once, that was race number 131, where Martingale finished on board, placed fourth to La Efa. Subsequently, the race we are looking at is 155, which where Martingale finished seventh. The winner of this race was Cape Wickham. Race number three is the Digo Rivera Handicap Division 2. Handicap for maiden horses, three years old only, rated 20 to 45 in class 4. No whips allowed in this race. Number one is Biafesson. Biafesson has benefit of one run during the last OT racing season. We are looking at race number 27 where Biafesson finished sixth, which was run over 1300 meters and won by Admiral Shaw. Biafesson now runs in six for longs. Number two is Dancing Grace. Dancing Grace has benefit of two runs during the last OT racing season. Race number 41 where Dancing Grace finished fifth to Kings Walk and we're looking at the race is race number 111 where Dancing Grace finished fourth to Andorra. We're looking at three horses, number three, Lord Ray, number nine, Boltonic, and number ten, MSG Fantasy. All these three runners ran in race number 155. Lord Ray has benefit of two runs, and in this race, Lord Ray finished third, while number nine, Boltonic, in the same race, finished 11th, and number 10, MSG Fantasy, finished on the wrong side of the field, which was run over 1,400 meters. The winner of this race was Cape Wickham and all these three runners now run in a 1200 meters. Number four we are looking at is Sacreca. Sacreca has benefit of one run during the last OT racing season and this is race number 41 where Sacreca ran sixth in a 1300 meter race. The winner of this race was King's Walk. Number six is Gatlin. Gatlin also has benefit of one run during the current racing season, which was race number nine, where Gatlin finished 11th, which was run over 1100 meters. The winner of this race was Royal Falcon. Number seven is Magical Wave. Magical Wave has benefit of three runs during the last OT racing season, but failed to find a place on board we're looking at race number 131 which was magical waves last outing where magical wave finished six the winner of this race was la Efa. number eight is royal symbol royal symbol has benefit of two runs during the last ot racing season Race number 111, Royal Symbol finished 7 to Andorra. And in her last outing, which was race number 120, what we're looking at, she finished 8th. The winner of this race was Berrettini, who won this race by a comfortable margin of 6 lengths. Race number 4, the Digo Rivera Handicap Division 1. Handicap for maiden horses, 3 years old only, rated 20 to 45 in Class 4. No whips are allowed in this race. Number one is Lebua. Lebua has benefit of one run during the current Madras racing season. But before that, in the last outing of hers, in race number 23 at, at the OT racing season, Lebua finished second. And uh, race number 10, which was her last outing this season, also finished second to Berrettini. Number two is Night Jar. Night Jar has benefit of two runs during the last OT racing season. In both the outings, Night Jar was placed second race number 41. She finished second to Kings Walk and race number 120. She finished second to Berrettini. Number three is Attenborough. Attenborough has benefit of a run at the Pony race course, race number 69 that we are looking at, Attenborough finished 10th. The winner of this race was Wild Thing.
Number five is Star Lab. Star Lab has benefit of three runs during the last Madras racing season and Star Lab runs after a long layoff. What we're looking at here is race number 176 of the last Madras racing season where Star Lab finished third. The winner of this race was K Star. Number six, Windsor Walk. Windsor Walk has benefit of three runs during the last OT racing season. Initial outing, Windsor Walk finished second. Subsequently, failed to produce the same gallop. Race number 21 finished second. And last outing, which was in race number 109, finished seven. The winner was Illustrious Ruler. Number eight is Little Wonder. We are looking at is race number 131. Illust Little Wonder has benefit of three runs. In the last two T racing season, in this race, which is race number 131, Little Wonder finished 8th. The winner of this race was La Yafa. Number 10 is Sunny Isles. Sunny Isles has benefit of 3 runs during the last OT racing season. Sunny Isles also has not made any impressions as yet. All the 3 runs finished off board. We are looking at is race number 155 where Sunny Isles finished 8 to Cape Wickham. Race number 5, the Super White Handicap. This is for horses rated 60 to 85 in Class 2. Outstation horses are eligible. Distance, 1400 meters. Number 1 is Angelino. Angelino has benefit of 2 runs during the last OT racing season. Initial outing race number 121. Angelino finished 4th to Hope and Glory. And uh, we're looking at this race is race number 153, which was a terms race run over eight furlongs. Where Priceless won this race by three and a half lengths and Angelino finished sixth. We're looking at three horses, number two, Funstorm, number three, Glorious Destiny and number nine, Gallantry. Number two, Funstorm. Two outings in the last two T racing season, race number 122 finished fourth, came out and won a subsequent outing which was race number 140 and uh, last outing we are looking at is race number 7 of the current Madras racing season where Funstorm finished second to Priceless Ruler while Glorious Destiny in the same race finished fifth and number 9 Gallantry finished third. We are again looking at three horses. Number four, Ayur Shakti. Number six, Renegade. And number seven, Cuban Pete. Number four, Ayur Shakti has benefit of five runs. Last outing, what we are looking at is race number 151, where Ayur Shakti finished second to V. Savage, while Renegade, who's got an impressive record, out of six runs, two wins, twice placed, and last outing, race number 151, finished seventh. And number 7, Cuban Pete, finished 11 to V. Savage. We are looking at number 8, Euphoric. Euphoric ran many a times during the UT racing season. And uh, last outing of the UT racing season, race number 136, which was run over 8 furlongs, won the race by about half a length beating Remedies of Spring. And uh, this is what we are looking at is race number 13 of the current Madras racing season, which was run over eight furlongs, won by a very comfortable. We are looking at number 10, Offshore Breeze in this frame. Offshore Breeze has benefit of three runs during the last OT racing season. One placed and uh, a win that was in race number 22. And what we are looking here is race number 129, where Offshore Breeze finished 10. The winner of this race was Passe. Number 11 is Angel Heart. Angel Heart also has benefit of three runs during the last OT racing season. And all the three times Angel Heart has been on board, race number 15 finished third. Race number 47 finished second to Rhiannon and this is the last outing which was race number 122 which was run over six furlongs where Angel Hart won this race fighting with Katadin.
Number 12 is Speed Air. Speed Air has benefit of one run during the current Madras racing season. What we are looking at is race number 24, where Speed Air finished second. The winner of this race was Ignorance's Bliss, won very well on a tight train by about two and a half lengths. Race number 6, the Noble Eagle Handicap. This is for horses rated 40 to 65 in class 3, distance 1000 meters. Number one is First Empress. First Empress has benefit of three runs during the last OT racing season. Initial race, which was race number 15, First Empress finished second. Subsequently, in race number 113, was second at the bend and suddenly dropped back and finished 12th and uh, came out and won the subsequent outing, which was race number 124 by one length and was up by nine points. Number two is Diamond and Pearls and number three, Constant Variable. We are looking at two horses which participated in the race number 15 of the current Madras racing season. Number two, Diamond and Pearls has been a consistent performer. All through has been on board, including a win in the last OT racing season. And race number 15, which was the last outing, finished fourth to Golden Marina, while number three, Constant Variable, in the same race, finished second. Golden Marina won this race by a margin of five and three quarter lengths. Number four is Succession and number seven is Rhiannon. We are looking at two horses. Number four, Succession has benefit of two runs during the current Madras racing season. And both the occasions, Succession placed second to the same winner, which was Cartel. Race number 16, second to Cartel. Race number 22, second to Cartel. While number seven, Rhiannon, in the same race, finished 11th. Rhiannon has benefited three runs during the current Patras racing season and finished 11th in race number 22. Number five is Alexander. Alexander has benefited of two runs during the last OT racing season. Race number 31, Alexander finished sixth. And uh, what we are looking at is race number 128, where Alexander finished ninth. The winner of this race was Race for the Stars. Number six, Embrace, and number eight, Butterfly. Both ran in race number six of the current Petras racing season. Number six, Embrace, finished third. The winner of this race was Thomas Hardy, while number eight, Butterfly, finished sixth. Thomas Hardy won this race by a margin of two and a quarter lengths. Number 9, Tudor, and number 12, Pirate Slav. Number 9, Tudor, has benefit of one run. We are looking at is race number 16 of the current Madras racing season, where Tudor finished 7th, while number 12, Pirate Slav, who also has a benefit of one run during the current Madras racing season, finished 3rd. The winner of this race was Cartel. We are looking at number 10, Ginsburg. Ginsburg, after winning a race during the last OT racing season, which was race number 16, ran over six furlongs, went over to Pune. And uh, in Pune, in race number 25, which was run over five furlongs, finished seventh to Chelini. And what we are looking at is race number 60, where Ginsburg finished way behind Pepper, who won this race. Number 11 is Demerara. Demerara has benefit of two runs during the current Madras racing season. First race, that was race number six. Demerara finished fourth to Thomas Hardy. And we are looking at race number 24, where Demerara finished nine to Ignorance's Bliss. Race number seven, the Algeciras Handicap Division 1. This is for horses rated 20 to 45 in class four, distance 1400 meters. Number one is Supreme Dance. Supreme Dance has benefit of one run during the current Madras racing season. That was race number two where Supreme Dance won this race by a comfortable margin of four and a quarter lengths. And Supreme Dance now runs 
with 13 points plus. Number two is Priceless Beauty. Priceless Beauty has benefit of two runs during the last OT racing season. Race number 30, which was run over 1400 meters, which was 1000 guineas. Priceless Beauty finished second to Remedies of Spring. And what we are looking at is the Neil Giri's Derby, race number 77, where Priceless Beauty finished 10th. Queen Spirit won this race. Number three is King's Walk. King's Walk has benefit of one run during the current Madras racing season. And this is race number 12, what we are looking at, where King's Walk finished fifth. The winner of this race was Forever, who won this race by a margin of five and three quarter lengths. Number four is Right Move and number seven is Cardinosity. Number four, Right Move has benefit of one run. Race number four, where Right Move finished 10th and number seven in the same race finished 7th. That is Cardinosity finishing 7th to Supreme Runner. Number 5 is Lady Cadet. Lady Cadet ran twice during the Pune racing season. Lady Cadet won the initial outing in Pune, which was race number 32, run over 6 furlongs, and subsequent outing race number 44, which was run over 1400 meters, which was a terms race, finished 4th. The winner here was Wordsmith. We are looking at number 6, Laifa. Laifa has benefit of one run during the last OT racing season. As you can see, which was race number 131, where safety drifted out, taking Laifa out. And the rider of Laifa Hindu Singh lodged a successful objection against safety, which was upheld by the stewards. So Laifa wins this race in the stewards room, which was race number 131. Number 8 is Sporting Spirit. Sporting Spirit ran twice during the last Madras racing season. And what we're looking at is race number 126. So before that, race number 81, Sporting Spirit finished second. And subsequently, race number 126 also finished second. The winner of this race was Augusta. Number nine is Sinoja. Sinoja ran once during the last OT racing season. This is race number 27 that we are looking at where Sinosha finished fourth run over 1300 meter race and the winner of this race was Admiral Shaw. Number 10, Parry O'Connor. Parry O'Connor ran once during the last OT racing season. Race number 155 is what we are looking at where Paris O'Connor finished 10th the winner of this race was Cape Wickham. Number 11 is Chaitanya. Chaitanya has benefit of one run during the current Madras racing season. And this is race number 5, what we are looking at. And Chaitanya finished third. Chaitanya was fifth at the bend, gradually improved to finish third. The winner of this race was Royal Treasure. Number 12 is Ginger Snap. Ginger Snap has run twice this season. Initial race, which was race number 5, Ginger Snap finished 10th to Royal Treasure. And subsequently, race number 29, Ginger Snap finished 9th to Cape Wickham. Race number 8, the Algeceras Handicap Division 2. Handicap for horses rated 20 to 45 in Class 4 distance 1400 meters number one is Windermere Windermere has benefit of one run during the last OT racing season and a winner that to race number 143 which was run over 1400 meters Windermere won this race by a margin of two lengths beating bright light to second place number two is Becom Becom has run many a times during the last OT racing season and uh, not found place on board in the last six or seven outings. This is race number 152. What we are looking at is become finished eighth to star romance. Number three, Ruby Rosa. 
Ruby Rosa has benefit of two runs during the last OT racing season. Race number 37, Ruby Rosa finished fifth. And subsequent outing, what we're looking at is race number 77, which is the Neil Giri's Derby, where Ruby Rosa finished seventh to Queen Spirit. Number four is Abilitaire. Abilitaire has benefit of five runs during the last OT racing season, including a place and a win. And what we are looking at is race number 135, which was run over 1,600 meters, where Abilitaire finished sixth. The winner of this race was Lakshanam. Number five is Marshall. What we are looking at is the current Madras racing season, race number 11, where Marshall won this race comfortably by a margin of four and a half lengths. Welcome Chakram finished second to Marshall in this race. Number six is Lady Luck. Lady Luck has run just once during the last OT racing season and uh, we are looking at is race number 112 where Lady Luck finished third. The race was run over 1100 meters. The winner of this race was Slanche. Number 7, Kundwai. Number 8, Memory Lane. Both ran in race number 139, while number 7, Kundwai, was got benefit of one run during the last OT racing season, finished ninth, and in the same race, number 8, Memory Lane, has got benefit of four runs, finished seventh in race number 139, which was won by Angwai. Number 9 is Break the Silence. Break the Silence has benefit of two runs during the current Madras racing season. The first race was race number 1 where Break the Silence finished second to Dancing Queen and what we are looking at is race number 19 where Break the Silence finished fourth to Lord of the Turf. Number 10 is Fast Play. Fast Play has benefit of one run during the current Madras racing season and we are looking at race number 2 where Fast Play finished eighth in the race which was run over six furlongs. The winner of this race was Supreme Dance. Number 11 is Bella Amor. Bella Amor also has benefit of one run during the current Madras racing season. Race number 9 this is where Bella Amor finished way behind the winner which was Royal Falcon. Run over a distance of 1100 meters. Bella Amor now runs in 7 furlongs.